Nobody cares how fast you run. And that's what makes you and the sport great. When I say nobody cares how fast you run, I mean others may have an interest in how well you're doing or what you achieve. They may look up your times after a race and compare themselves to you. But at the end of the day, this is only an interest. They don't really care. Nobody has lost sleep because you ran poorly and the times you've run haven't affected anyone's lives. But this should not be seen as demotivating, it should be seen as completely the opposite. The running community is well known for being encouraging and supporting one. But when people want you to do well, it's not because it affects them in any way, but they understand what hard work you've put in. Any failure to meet up to expectations and it's not suddenly going to change anything to do with them. So, the question is asked, if nobody cares how fast you run, and however well you run, you're still going to receive encouragement. How is this motivating? It is motivating, and this is also why the sport is great. It is motivating because you're not running to prove anything to anybody else. Not because someone is forcing you to. You are running because that's what you want to do. This says a lot about you as a person. Determination. The ability to continue trying to do something although it is very difficult. Most runners when asked will tell you they do not enjoy every aspect of training because it is hard, it hurts, sometimes the weather is bad and everyone has those days where they just can't be bothered. Yet, you see people mentally fight through the pain and achieve everything they set out to do through pure hard graft. They have put the time in, hours and hours a week behind the scenes which many non-runners just don't understand. Just so if and when it comes to it, and the race is available, they can perform to the level they want to. The vast majority of runners have many other things going on in their lives, whether that be school, work, or one of the countless things that happens to us day to day during our lifetimes. We could just make excuses as to why we don't want to train because we're too tired and we haven't got time. But you as a runner have the determination to succeed and you don't let these excuses get in your way. And again, I remind you, this is not because other people care how well you do it's because you want to do well for yourself. Each and every runner has their own personal set of goals. My goals are gonna be different to your goals, and your goals will be different to someone else's. But the one thing we all have in common is the hard work we need to put in to achieve those goals. One thing you learn as you get faster is running just doesn't get any easier. The pain is still the same. Somebody running five kilometers in over 30 minutes will go through exact same thing as someone running in under 20. If the effort is the same, they will both have very similar experiences. Just one person's all last longer. Which is why the running community is so supportive because the faster runners understand the pain and the emotions the slower runners go through and the slower runners appreciate the hard work the faster runners have done to get to where they are. I think I'm starting to lose track of what I wanted to get through in this video but remember you are determined and will persevere through the ups and downs. You will hit your goals because you're not having to prove something to someone else but because that's what you want to do and all these things together is what makes you a runner. This video is something a little different to what I normally do and it's possibly just completely nonsensical but if you happen to like it, please hit that like button and consider hitting the subscribe button too. I've been The Learning Runner and I'll see you in the next one.